For those of you who don't know me already, I want to introduce myself. My name is Darian Craig. I'm the founder of Y'all Sweet Tea. And today I want to talk about a little bit of the history of our company before we go into the new exciting movement that we're pushing our brand towards. Um, in 2015, we started this company with just a couple hundred dollars and an idea that we wanted to make the best sweet tea that you've ever drank and make it for as many people as we could get it to. And we did just that. On a $400 investment, we bought jars just like this one here. We had the name Y'all Sweet Tea, got the stickers made. We literally went to Walmart and bought as much tea and sugar as they had on the shelves. We made it at my Nana's house, sold it to the pumpkin patch, and that is how Y'all Sweet Tea began selling in this exact mason jar. This is the very first jar we ever put together. So for the first few months, we sold sweet tea out of that exact mason jar right there, and we sold hundreds of them, thousands of them. And we realized very quickly that this is something that a lot of people really wanted and that the tea that we were making was really good. But there was one problem. We were literally using my Nana's recipe and buying whatever tea we could find. So that was Red Diamond, that was Louisiana, that was literally we were buying whatever tea it was, but we knew we had a really good recipe. And that's one thing that had uh, us a little bit different than the other people was our recipe. So fast forward a couple months, we made a relationship with Red Diamond and we bought, we were buying tea directly from them, buying sugar directly from them. And again, our recipe really made that sweet tea taste a little bit better than what the average uh, tea, sweet tea drinker is used to drinking and a lot of people loved it. We sold at farmers markets all over the south. We sold at festivals and county fairs all over the south and we, and we never really had an imagination of where we wanted this thing to go. We just knew there was two things that were, that were very important. Um, one, our sweet tea is really good. We made good tea and people loved it. And the second thing is we loved seeing that smile on everybody's faces when they had that nice glass of tea out on a hot summer day, wherever we were at in the country. And that was one thing that was addictive was seeing those smiles, seeing people holding that jar and just being really, really proud of it. So as a, biz as a business owner, I'm seeing, you know, we're, we're moving in the right places, we're doing all the right things, but the business wasn't necessarily growing. Um, a ton. We had we got to a bunch of different events per weekend, and, and we were making good money. But it wasn't. I didn't see a way to scale the business to really make it uh, nationwide, or even even take over um, an entire region of the country without doing something a little bit different. So we almost we were so close to doing franchising that business model. And I'm going to pop up some pictures on the screen here uh, from our old past events that we would sell at. And a lot of you probably remember these events. And it was those things that founded our uh, our love for this, what we were doing. But we got to that roadblock where we're like, what do, what can we do to help grow this business and really make it bigger? Because there was people wanting to buy our tea online. We didn't know how to do that. Um, it's expensive to ship a liquid gallon of tea and and, uh, it, and it really didn't make sense to do, right? So we, we racked our brain and racked our brain. And it finally came to a point where the business had plateaued at a level that we didn't really think without a lot of employees and a lot of um, different home bases, as you could say, um, all over the South, we didn't really see it growing anymore. So we tabled the idea. Uh, that was in 2017 when we tabled the idea and kind of stepped away and, and really just put our minds together for the last three or four years, put our minds together on how can we grow this thing? How can we give sweet tea to everybody? Um, we know we have a great recipe. We know we have a great brand. Our brand name is fun. Our colors are fun. Um, but how can we get that tea delivered to every single person in the country? And um, I'm, I'm very happy to say we figured that out.